to test your friendship, would you let Millie Bobby Brown actually give you a haircut? How are you? How are you doing? I'm good. I'm feeling quite good. I've had a few diet cakes, so I'm caffeinated. Good, 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 good. <laughs> Um, congratulations on the film. I watched it the other day. I loved every single second. And I have to say, your entrance, truly a highlight. Really? Oh, brilliant. It was, really, it was great. <laughs> Falling out of the bag. Perfect. Hello. Please get out of this carriage. I want to jump right in. Obviously, Enola Holmes, action-packed, so many stunts. There's a great sequence at the end where you find yourself in a bit of trouble. Tewkesbury comes face to face with danger. How was that for you when you filmed it? Was it as intense as it was for me watching it? Completely. It was more intense. Oh, it was insane. The effects that you see, like the explosions, happened right there while I was there. So I was, I mean, a lot of my reactions were genuine reactions. You see this thing blow up and I had ear mufflers in because it was so loud, but I mean, it was still like, ah. so a lot of them, a lot of the reactions was, I mean, properly real. And there was this one, this night, like this armor that completely shatters uh, when it's shot. And they told me that it was gonna, it was gonna break, but I mean, I'd forgotten because I was so, I was trying to get into the zone, into this action scene. So it was a complete surprise. So I, I just had no idea that it was gonna go it was right next to me. <laughs> so that was like your real reaction, basically. Much yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the dynamic between Tewkesbury and Enola as well. I know a lot of people are going to love it. I loved it. Um, I feel like that's down in part to yours and Millie's friendship, which is just so great to see on screen. There's a scene in the film where Enola cuts Tewkesbury's hair. But to test your friendship, would you let Millie Bobby Brown actually give you a haircut? No way. No, no. way. I mean, she's very energetic. She could not keep her hands still. That is a straight no. I mean, in the film, she's a pretty good job. I mean, you see it at the scene after. God, she's pretty good. Yeah. But real life, no. <laughs> I'd rather do it myself. <laughs> if we get to see Tewkesbury again in a sequel, maybe one day, where do you feel like Enola and his relationship could go? Do you think it's more romantic or do you see them more as more of a dynamic duo? It's really, yeah, it's an interesting question. And I like that we, you know, it's not one thing. Like the end of the film, I like that it's left sort of up in the air. I really, really like that. And it's not one thing. I mean, I'd like to see a bit more of both, to be honest. If, I think their relationship's so great that it's, you know, it, it could go either way completely, but you sort of appreciate it for what it is. But I would, I would like to see it. I'm not sure. I'd like to see them together again because I think they work great as a dynamic duo, as you say. But I mean, the undoubtedly a bit of that flirtiness that's always, you know, that would always be going on between two two. Yeah. Head. Well, I'd, we'd love to see more. I'm sure it's going to be a fan favorite. I've come here because I've grown to like you more in your absence, and because, as it turns out, your life is still in danger. What's made you like me more? Really. That is your question, not who is trying to kill me. My last question for you, with Enola Holmes, you are now part of the Netflix world. If you could be in any Netflix show, which one would you choose and why? Definitely definitely not Chernobyl, if that's, if that's on Netflix. <laughs> no, oh, what would I be? Mean? Good question. Would you join Millie in Stranger Things? No, that again, that world is also equally... <laughs> Too much. Somewhere, somewhere a bit more relaxing. I don't know if you've seen White Lines on Netflix. I mean, that looks pretty nice. You know, the Ibiza setting. I'm a big fan of Ozark, so I'm thinking uh -huh. of that. Wouldn't like to be a part of Peaky Blinders. I'd like to be a part. You know, I'd like the haircut and you know, I like, I like all that. Actually, maybe I'll go. <laughs> I'd just be. i just be one of the less violent characters. I reckon. <laughs> yeah. Have a nice chill storyline. It's all good. Yeah. Thank you so much. I loved you in this film. Can't wait for everyone else to watch it. Thank you. Yeah. Nice to meet you.